Yeah, I mean, not a good performance in every in any facet, really. Um, obviously, the big play in the game was the double play ball up the middle that Will tried to bare hand and cut his finger in the process. Not only do we not get the double play ball or, or any outs, but, um, you know, Will had a cut on his finger, and um, you could tell he was kind of struggling to feel the baseball after that. But, um, you know, still – you know, I don't know, maybe I should go to Manasi sooner in that situation, but, um, you know, I just felt like he had made enough pitches against that left-handed hitter that, you know, maybe he could get a big strike out there and, and um, you know, a double play ball and, and kind of keep us, you know, keep us at 1-1. But um, unfortunately, the lefty did a good job and battled, you know, fouled off four or five balls, maybe six, um, single to right, and then um, and then the kind of the inning went downhill from there. But um you know, and it's one of those things when you got a game tomorrow and you get down six, seven runs in our league, um, you know, it's hard to justify throwing your kind of better bullpen guys when you need them tomorrow. So, again, disappointing loss. Um, you know, I'm, I'm really at a loss. I mean, we need to we need to play better. I mean, I don't I wish I had answers, but, um, you know, we'll come out tomorrow and and, you know, we need a good start out of rep. Um, how close were you to making a change with Will there with the with this cut finger? Yeah, I mean the problem was it just you know Manasi hadn't really thrown any pitches. I mean we you know we needed to get him. I mean we could have we could have called an injury timeout, but or or put Manasi in you know in an injury situation. But again, you know it seemed like he kind of settled down after the walk um, to the to Leonard who was trying to bunt. Um, seemed like he settled down and was making some pitches after that. So. You know, just one of those things where his pitch count was low and, you know, we certainly wanted to get him deeper into the game. And, and um, but to answer your question, I mean, really close. Um, but, um, you know, it's just a tough call. Tom, do you worry about uh, these things kind of snowballing? I know it's kind of what I asked you yesterday, but I mean, do you worry about the, the headspace of this team with, with, some guys who have been through seasons like this before where it's just seemed to get away from you around this time of the year? Yeah, I mean, I don't know that we've had seasons where it's gotten away from us at this time of year, uh, at least with this group. I mean, a couple of years ago um, in 2019, we were kind of playing our best baseball down the stretch. Um, so, you know, again, as far as these guys, I don't know that we've had in 2018, you know, when these guys were freshmen, you know, we didn't pitch it very well, but but again, the guys kept fighting and we got better as the season went on. So I, I certainly do expect this team to get better as the season goes on. But, um, you know, again, you know, we need good starts and we we got a mediocre start out of Ryan Cusick yesterday. And, and again, you know, whether it was because of the finger or, or what, we got a, a, a mediocre at best start out of Will Fleming today. So, um, you know, when you get good starts on the weekend, you have chances to win. Where's this team's headspace right now? Yeah, we're reeling. I mean, I you know, there's no question about it. I mean, I think, you know, you got Bobby Seymour's been struggling at the plate. Muntz has been struggling at the plate. Lanzo's been kind of up and down. Um, so you got these older guys that, that are in their draft year and, and they, they want to go on and play professional baseball, but they're statistically they're struggling um, and the team's struggling along with them. And they, so part of this is draft related, but part of it is then they just want to help their team and, and help us win. And, you know, they're, they haven't put them, themselves in position for the draft or to help us win. So it's like just one of those things where we, we need to, you know, again, we need to, we need to just get on those, one of those kind of roles where everything seems to be bouncing our way right now. Everything seems to be bouncing the, the wrong way. Does this put any more pressure on Louder for tomorrow? No, I mean, no more than last week. I mean, you know, it's kind of the same situation last week. You know, you go into Sunday, you know, having to have a win. Um, so, I, you know, Rhett, you know, he's got a pretty low heartbeat. So I, <laughs> you know, I expect him to go out there and, and pitch well. And, and I think he's a good matchup for these guys. I think they don't handle off-speed pitches particularly well. If you can pitch backwards with these guys, you, you can have some success. So I, I think, well, I think Rhett will have a good outing. Any idea about lingering effects for Will with his finger? No way to project if he'll be ready next week or too early to look at that? I think too early. I mean, I, I would be surprised if he weren't ready. It was just kind of one of those things where you got maybe a little split fingernail. Um, okay. But, um, you know, I think it's going to be 
I don't think it's anything where there's anything broken or anything. You guys good? All right. Yep. Thanks, Coach. Appreciate it. Thanks, Walt. Thanks, Tom. Yes. All right, Brennan, how are you? Good, how are you doing? Good. Um, just uh, sorry for how obvious this is going to be, but where, where's the team's headspace right now after last night and then today? I mean, obviously, we're not down on ourselves. We're not playing our best baseball, clearly. But, I mean, we're still hopeful. We're going to turn it around. And when we do, it's going to be – I mean, it's going to be scary. We're a really good team. We're just not playing well right now. What's going to be like if if you're even able to to identify it before it might happen? What's going to be the sign to you to know that you guys are turned around and and playing the way you're capable of playing? I mean, once we start playing better defense, our pitching gets good and our hitting gets good. I mean, we're really not doing anything great right now. So just something needs to click. We just need to start playing better baseball. How weird is it that like? Everything's going wrong at the same time, Brendan. Could you repeat that? Sorry. I was like, how hard and how weird is it that like everything seems to be going wrong all at the same time? I mean, it's unfortunate. It clearly it's showing on the field, but I mean, we'll turn it around. It's, I mean, it's been a long year. We've been away from baseball, but we just got something's got to click. Every other team's playing. We just got to, we got to step it up. What gives you the confidence that you guys can turn this around? I mean, we have tremendous talent. We got a really good team. So at any at any point the team could turn it around. We got really good pitching, we got really good hitting, and we got defenders. So I mean, it's just a matter of time before it clicks. Is there anything that that Walt can say or Billy or or John or anybody? any of the captains, like, is there anything that can be said to turn this around? Or is it just, at this point, it just needs to come across in actions and, you know. I mean, we can, we can yell at each other all we want. We can try to fire each other up. But I mean, it's once we start, it's gotta be actions. We gotta, someone's gotta take charge, start playing the way that we can play. And I mean, I think we can talk all we want, but I mean, it's gotta be on the, the actions. We'll, we'll click, something will click with that. For you, how good is it to finally like kind of be back and playing every day? Oh, it feels awesome. I mean, I've been going through injuries for a year, so I mean, it's it feels great to be back on the field. Feel like it was good to also drive a ball today. Yeah, it felt good. I mean, I've been I've been having some weak contact, so it, just knocking the rust off will matter of time before we start hitting a little better. Anything else, guys? Thanks, Brendan. Thanks, Brendan. Thanks, guys. Thanks, Brendan.